Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. I've been learning a lot, and most people who have documented their weight loss, if it's like a big number, a lot of the people gained it back, just like me. And so I realize that I'm not alone. That just makes me realize that there are people that want to know how a person like me and a person like you can learn to be healthy, learn to love ourselves, be at peace with who we are, no matter what size that we are. When we start gaining weight, then we kind of lose our identity as far as who we truly are inside. I think we just identify as a fat person or as somebody who is less than. And I think that that's what happens when you start losing weight is you, uh, you finally start feeling like you're important and that uh, you matter again. And we need to realize that we're important and that we matter right now. There's a real great need for people like me to learn how to love ourselves and to love ourselves healthy instead of finding a way to lose weight so that we can love ourselves. And so that's kind of the turn that I want to take with my channel. As I was watching the other YouTube videos for the other people who have lost weight and then gained it back, and there are people that haven't, that didn't gain it back. And it's interesting because I think the people that didn't gain the weight back, they probably had setbacks. Maybe they did have like a month or two where they gained weight, but then they just got back on track and they just kept forgiving themselves and kept going. And the people that gain more weight is because they feel shame and they feel embarrassed and they don't want to just accept that we're all gonna fail. Like if I'm on this journey, and it takes me, you know, five years to lose 150 pounds, that's okay, you know, I don't have to lose 150 pounds in one or two years. As long as I'm going towards uh, taking care of myself and nurturing my spirit and nurturing who I am, and actually starting to do the things that I love to do also, instead of waiting to live my life until I'm thin. Why don't I live my life now the best that I can? I'm going to put out another video probably next week, kind of doing a new intro video for my channel. I think that me losing the 85 pounds and gaining them back was just part of my journey and that is something I had to do in order to get to where I am now and to realize that it's not about getting skinny and it's about being healthy and it's about loving yourself. And so I'm excited. Please subscribe follow my journey. I love your encouragement. I love your messages. Um, send me a comment of something that you want to learn or you'd love me to share. And let's just go through this together. I'm really excited. I actually feel really hopeful. I am determined to become the woman that Heavenly Father has designed me to be. And I've always been somebody who could easily get their um, cup filled, I guess, by outward sources and so I easily can make friends. I you know, was talented and so I got attention for a lot of things and so I was easily able to manipulate getting my, my cup filled from the outside of me. And so that's one thing that I need to learn on this journey is to learn how to fill my cup from within me, from my spirit, from God and not through food and not through other people. And that is also going to be part of the piece of this journey for me. Well, I wouldn't have known that if I hadn't have gone through all of this. So I've been not very good at uh, loving myself lately. And so I'm gonna do better at that. And I hope you guys do too. That's your challenge this week is to try to love yourself a little bit more today and forgive yourself you know, for things that you do that you wish you hadn't because that's what life is all about is learning. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel because awesome things are going to happen. Please like and subscribe and I will see you next week.